Well, I just got probably the worst news I can possibly get. Uh, thanks to Chick Kick 21 for ruining my day. But uh, hey, she's a good girl. She was nice enough to invite me and you, as in you, mm -hmm. to uh, to her wrestling school, where Edge, Natalia, and Beth Phoenix are gonna be. <laughs> and here we are going to a, a hockey game, right, which I, I don't mind. Three. But man, listen, Edge. you're going to Mania. Stop bitching. I could have met Edge. We're gonna meet him in April. Could have met Edge for free. Nothing's ever good enough for this kid, I'm telling you. Damn. Oh. I, she sent me the text and I'm my face. Ah! You're kidding. Edge, Natalia, and Beth Phoenix. How do I, like, miss that? Oh well. But that's what's going on with me. I'm kind of all, all upset. Kind of missing to meet Edge. But, but thanks, babe. You're the best. Thanks, thanks. for. Uh, Thanks for thinking of us. We appreciate it. I appreciate okay. it. All right, we'll see ya. I'm a little upset right now. I have no idea. I, I, I've never seen a, a, a Japanese born pitcher come over here. She got the plate thing for the front of my car now, too. to be good or bad. Um, it, it's a change of life. You're asking the best pitch. In his mind, he, he believes he's the best pitcher in the world, which I love. Uh, physically.
Buffalo Sabres game, 6-0 the score against Boston. Now, if I came here and I said they were going to win, I would be bullshitting out of my rear end. But 6-0, shutout for Miller. I'm sure half of you don't even care what's going on. But very excited because the first time we came here, uh, they lost 4-3 in overtime. So, oh yeah, there you go. Here's your cameraman getting involved in the shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I took it away from the celebrity. Thank you. No problem. Okay, this is just the uh, end of the video. Sorry, I kind of cut it short, but uh, uh, today wasn't the best day for me, honestly. It was as soon as I woke up, I good news, you know, whatever. Uh, MC, uh, a lot of people know him as NWA wrestling fan tweeted me and told me that Natalia and Beth Phoenix were doing an autograph signing <coughs> in Toronto. So I was like, okay. The original plan for myself and Jade was to go to Buffalo right in the morning because we stayed literally like five minutes from the border. So the original plan was to go to Buffalo and uh, we kind of talked and we agreed that next week we would go and then today we would go meet Beth Phoenix and Natalia. And Beth Phoenix tweeted it saying her and Natalia will be doing a signing. So, we packed our stuff, and we were hitting the road at 12 o'clock, noon. Signing started at 2 o'clock. So, we, by the time we get home, we're reading tweets, we get calls from people saying that it's not to the public. It's, so it's a private signing, so to say. And by this time, it was already 12.45, and I just got home. So, it was like, okay. We find out when we get home, it, 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 it was a private signing. The place that they were supposed to sign had no idea what was going on. So we pretty much wasted our 50 minutes, pretty much an hour, driving from Niagara Falls to wherever, my house. So now we have to drive back because we could go to Toronto, but it's not like we were there all the time. So we went back to Buffalo, which was another hour drive, and um, we get pulled over at the border. So we get questioned at the border because we were there the previous day. So now they did a whole inspection of my car. They started questioning me and Jade what we were doing, what's with us, what are like, you know, pretty much what we're doing in their country, in your guys' country. So that took about 20 minutes. And by that time, I was exhausted. I didn't feel like filming. I didn't even want to go. I was like a zombie. And uh, so that's why I didn't film anything. But what I, I did pick up a couple things, nothing too extravagant, but... From Lids, uh, some of you, whatever, I got this Buffalo Savers frame. It's actually made out of glass. Nice quality. Got a little koozie here. And then I got a Daniel Bryan Elite Series action figure. And I got this Triple H Defining Moments. And those are the tickets from the game. We had a uh, section 117. Really good seats. I really enjoyed it. And this, Cherry Coke. The best thing you guys have produced in I don't know how long. We don't get these over here, so the I think the place was called uh, I don't even remember. They were selling three for twelve dollars, so I picked three up. Two are downstairs, but this I'm telling you, so good. Vanilla Coke is garbage, but Cherry Coke is the stuff. And uh, that's it. It's uh, my bag there. So I'm sorry, but you know sometimes you just gotta. You gotta, you know, I don't know. I'm just tired. I'm tired right now. I'm seriously gonna go to sleep really soon. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. The next one coming is in March, where I will be meeting Bret Hart. I'll see you guys then.